In this session, I'm going to explain about what is molality. Molality is defined as the number of moles of solute which are present in one kilogram of the solvent, not solution. And don't get confused with molarity and molality. Molarity is nothing but number of moles of solute which are present in one liter of the solution, not solvent. Here the molality is number of moles of solute present in one kg of the solvent. So molarity is about the mass concept, whereas the molarity is about volume concept. And the molality is denoted by small letter m or mole per kg. And the molality can be calculated by using the formula molality m is equal to number of moles of solute divided by mass of solvent in kg. Whereas number of moles of solute is equal to mass of solute divided by molecular mass of solute. To understand molality concept, we'll give an example that is 1 m solution of potassium chloride. It is small letter m. If it is capital letter m, that is molarity. Small letter m means molality. 1 m solution of potassium chloride means 1 moles of potassium chloride present in 1 kg of water solution or the aqueous solution. Let us solve some problems. First, calculate the molality of 2.5 gram of methanoic acid dissolved in 75 gram of toluene. Here the solute is methanoic acid whereas the solvent is toluene. First, write down the formula. It is molality M is equal to number of moles of methanoic acid divided by mass of solvent. Solvent is toluene, mass of toluene. First, uh, calculate the number of moles of methanoic acid. For that, the formula is number of moles of methanoic acid is equal to mass of methanoic acid divided by molecular mass of methanoic acid. Mass of methanoic acid is given in the problem. How much it is? 2.5 gram. Now we have to calculate the molecular mass of methanoic acid. Molecular mass is atomic mass of hydrogen that is 1. Here two hydrogen atoms are present. Hence it is into 2 plus atomic mass of carbon that is 12. Here only one carbon atom is there. Hence it is into 1 plus atomic mass of oxygen that is 16 here two oxygen atoms are present hence it is into 2 and the answer is 2.5 gram divided by 46 gram per mole gram per mole is a unit of molecular mass and the final answer is 0 0.05 mole here gram gram gets cancelled hence the unit is mole now we have to calculate the mass of the solvent Mass of the solvent is already given in the problem. How much it is? It is 75 gram. But we want the mass in kg. For that, we have to divide the mass by 1000. And the answer is 0 0.075 kg. Now, we know number of moles of uh, methanoic acid as well as mass of toluene. Now, we have to calculate the molality that is M is equal to 2, 0 0.05 mole divided by 0 0.075 kg. And the answer is 0 0.67 mole per kg. Mole per kg is also written as small m. Don't write capital letter M. Capital letter M is the unit of molarity. Uh, here it is molality. So, we have to write it small letter M. Here the final answer is 0 0.67 m. Next problem, calculate the molality of 40 gram of sodium hydroxide dissolved in 100 gram solution. Here the solute is given that is uh, sodium hydroxide and the solvent is not given. Here only the solution um, mass is given. Remember, first write down the formula. It is molality M is equal to the number of moles of solute divided by mass of solvent. First, we have to calculate the number of moles of solute. Here, the solute is sodium hydroxide. For that, the formula is mass of sodium hydroxide divided by molecular mass of sodium hydroxide. Mass of sodium hydroxide is given in the problem, that is 40 gram. Now, we have to determine the molecular mass of sodium hydroxide. It is 
the atomic mass of sodium that is 23 and the atomic mass of uh, oxygen that is 16 and the atomic mass of hydrogen that is plus 1. And the answer is 40 gram divided by 40 gram per mole. This gram per mole is the unit of molecular mass. 40 by 40 is 1. Gram gram gets cancelled and it is mole, 1 mole. Now we want mass of solvent. But here mass of the solution is given. From that how to calculate the mass of the solvent? We get mass of the solvent by subtracting mass of the solute by mass of the solution. So, mass of solvent is equal to mass of solution minus mass of solute. We know mass of solution that is 100 gram. Mass of solute is also known that is 40 gram. 100 minus 40 is nothing but 60 gram. But we want the mass of solvent in kg. So, we have to divide 60 by 1000 and the answer is 0 0.060 kg. Now we know mass of uh, solvent as well as number of moles of sodium hydroxide. Substitute its values to molality formula. So molality M becomes 1 mole divided by 0 0.06 kg. And the answer is 16.67 mole per kg. Mole per kg is also written as small m.